We're just a bit further in the in the woods here, but it's, as you can see, it's our it's, swamp. Like, it's yeah. our swamp. We've had to come from down there because it, we couldn't even get across the road down there. It's properly swamped in there, and we've come up under here. But at the same time, we did hear the green woodpecker again in here. Yeah, this green woodpecker, what you never see. Whoa. Aye. It's a the elusive green woodpecker. We'll have to change its name. We'll see it one day. Aye, we'll catch it. Keep saying we'll catch it, we'll see it. <laughs> ah, there it is. You can get it. We're going to try and creep up through uh, this, 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 this a half a footpath. It should have big young, at this, or, or even just young at this time of the year. Because we heard it drilling about at least, or oh, it was a good month ago, last time we were in here, when it was making its nest. But it was always just in this. Yeah, ah, it's, just in, it's just in front of us somewhere. I can see a dead oak in the middle of there. I'm just wondering. Ah, there. Or is it a crow? Ah, it's a crow. There's a quite a few. You know what you call a woodpecker when they eat it? Yeah. Headbanger. Headbanger. <laughs> it's um, a big crap, like It's mm -hmm. just up in front of us somewhere, Philip. You what? It's just up in front of us somewhere. I'm, I'm trying to pick a quiet way around. Bollocks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to pick a quiet way around. We're through this. Now we're through scaring it because it. So I'm thinking. So am I. It's, it's our swamp. Right, you know, it's just in these trees in front of us somewhere. There's a pigeon just flew out. I'm trying to be nice and quiet. <laughs> Philip's just trying to make as much noise as he can. I tell you what, it's hard work at the Oh, I know. I can actually see a nest up that tree there. It's that elderberry. Is it elderberry? Oh, no, not elderberry, man. I think it is. Aye, oh, elderberry, aye, it is. It's an elder. But a pigeon just flew to there a few minutes ago. But I'm not interested in the pigeon. It's a. Uh, It's the elusive. Yeah, I'm a little bit heavier, so I'm thinking more. Hi, <laughs> I'm just floating white on white on me. I did see a bit of a dead oak in here somewhere, and I was hoping we might find the green oak. We're getting deeper into bramble and swamp. I've never looked as bad on the video, does it? I know. I've just sunk in between two. My foot just went straight down in between there. Let me snap my leg. Oh. Oh. It's hard work. I'm trying to watch where I'm going at the same time with the camera. Ah, there's a couple of birds through there. Snapped off and I can see a woodpecker's hole in it. We might just head on looking here. There's the woodpecker hole there. I'm gonna I'll zoom back out and then we'll just go. Make my way over to it. Did we tell me from this woodpeckers? Oh Christ, man, I'll jump in more swamp. I'm thinking about jumping over here, but it's just, you didn't have that swamp over the other side. It looks murky as hell. Oh, shit, I'm jumping over. It's a little bit swampy. <laughs> Swarming flies and everything. Flies and midges and everything. Right, let's do a look at this. It's definitely a woodpecker's. Well, a little bit out of that, do you think? You can see the bottom of the hole looks as if it's been... It's just I'd love to just see the bird, to get a shot of the bird. Oh, Aye. The bottom of the hole looks as, as if it's getting used. But... Look around it and see if there's any like fresh chippings at the bottom. I'll turn the camera off for no one who doesn't save the battery until we just in case it's just in case it's now interesting. 
I'll save the battery and, and the memory cord just for extra footage in case we do come across anything. This is just a little blue tit's nest there. It's got about eight eggs in. We'll put these boxes up in the wood and it just shows how late these are. They should have had young at this time of year. But it's in the we're just a bit further along from where we are. Right from where we were, I should say. Just up into the swampy parts. We hit them well out the way of other people and that, but they are getting used. This is a small nest box. Quite a good idea. We'll just come down to the, the pond. It's a green side, that's a, the meadows are a small bit now. The pond's literally full of tadpoles, can you see them all? It, every space you look, there's millions of them, there must be. Right, they're just all of them. Even when you look further in the middle, that's all you can see. I mean, there must be millions, billions of mm -hmm. it. When we came down the other week, there was loads of frogs in it, wasn't there? Well, I mean, but there was no... Uh, the frogs, um, frogs spawning us. Oh, but there's... It'll make good food for all the birds that you would it, think would use aye, this pond. Would, that's what I'm saying, you would think there'd be a lot more. Aye. Yeah. We came down off the top there, and we've seen that there were either young coots or something. Here's a bit of an old coots nest there. But the, the birds only looked a few days old. You'd think there would be a lot more nests on here. One year we did find a, a Canada a Canada Canadian Could goose. Be a few days. A few years gone. All right. I think I've just heard the coot doing that. But you do get at least one or two pairs of coots on this pond. One at the bottom, one at the top. The size of the pond, you would think there would be a lot more. Aye. Right. There's never been a swan's yeah, nest on it. Never so been. We'll a, up the top end and just. I will have a quick look at the end of it. Up the top. We're just doing the bottom end of the pond there and straight across. I'm not sure if they're young birds, you can just see a couple of reeds in the water. It's oh, that's got uh, that's that's ready here, there. Just across there you can see it, they call it a dab chick. It's a little grebe. But I'm not so sure if these are young birds as well. Wow, uh, they're all our eye. It's just one another water there, there's, there's some in the reeds just there. Oh, there's another one. It's just popped up there. It's just popped up, aye, it's right back under. So they're definitely grebes then? Aye, like definitely that. grebes, they've got the red head in that. Like a slight colour of red on the heaps. But just there, that looks like the nest. So would then be early nesters then, like? It's the double and treble brooded. Yeah, so the wood be like the first aye. brood would be quite early on. Aye, and that's a... There it is. I can see it quite well over there. Yeah, yeah, it's just sitting there. It keeps coming under the water every time so I get on. What, what, would these be the tadpoles and stuff or? Aye. You, you do get them little type of minnow fish in here, we've seen them, haven't we? But they would actually eat tadpoles and stuff. Aye. So if there's any amount in here, I mean, it's like even anywhere in this pond, you know. Aye. There's another one. Aye, they're definitely the greaves then. Let's back up over there again. But there's at least four or five of them, don't you? Oh, I can see it, I. That's not a young bird, though. That's a that's one of the parent ones. There's that two one. there. Can you see? There's like a pair together, there, isn't it? There's three actually. Oh, has it got young with it? I either have. There's the big one. They've got. Little, can you see the oh, young? I can see. I've got the little chick on the camera here. Uh, so there's it's a couple of the. Ah, uh, it's got a few chicks with it. I thought when I first seen them, Aye. they looked tiny, the ones I'd first seen, so it must have been the trip. But these type of birds, it, it, um, they'll have the young out of the nest like that, and it'll start laying again within the same week, it, within a couple of weeks, in the Aye. same nest. 
Oh, yeah, it's, it's just across there in the reeds. I can just see it. I mean, it's it's not a lot of what I know. We pond there. Just oh, if I'm... I had a pond it's just a water from mean, and them ones used to do that. I know, enough of it, but not. They look lovely bit when you've got them on view. You can see the little trick and so it nearly looks like it's... It's on its back. Is it? I've, it's hard for me to see from you, but that's what I thought, like it was on its back. Ah, it's, it's, it's 100% on its back, I've got it on camera there. I didn't even realise they'd done it. Neither did I. And I had swans on that day, and ducks. Yeah. But they must just be freshly hatched. Good swimmers for being straight with the nest, mate. Because they're straight under the water then. But that's that's another good find, that. Because it's it's the first time I've known the little groups to be on this pond. So this pond, it's took it about 20 years, but it's matured and quite well. This pond, it was just an old a runoff from the tip. Mm. There's the bird over there again. Do they normally stick to the sides or will they often come come out into the middle or do they like to be They will come out in the middle, eye. They eat like the plantain, like the, the small grassy weedy type of stuff. It's like mm. ducks and all that. I didn't, I'm not even 100% sure what they eat. I know they eat vegetation and stuff like that and all that stuff, but I'm not sure about the tadpoles. I've got that one there chewing high in bits of reed about. But reeds are edible anyways, aren't they? Even bottles. This video is going to be a little bit shaky. I'll zoom back out so I'm not shaking all over the place with the camera. It's when you zoom in too far, it just shakes and bounces all over. Uh, but that's the grebe's nest there. Yeah. When I first came down, it actually jumped off the oh, nest. Aye. A bit there. You can see the little, one of the little chicks on its back, mate. Aye, it's definitely got one on its back, and there's one behind it as well. Two. Two, two nice. behind them. Oh, there's another one coming up. Third one, it's like... The, the oh, it's just behind them, hi. That was worth coming in here. Because at the most, you've just seen the cuts. We did find a oh. Canada goose here one year, but that was only once. And you get the cuts in the water, and... but the grebe's a good find in here. And that's what that is. But we didn't find the nest earlier on when some eggs, so we could have took a shot. Aye. Trouble yeah. is, when you scare them off, they cover the eggs when they read. Uh, now, so you'll never even know that they've got eggs from, like, from here. That just looks like an old nest. They cover them. They lay a white egg, but by the time it's been stained off all that wet stuff, no, it, ends up, it ends up just all stained and it like, looks like a doggy broom colour. It might even have eggs under there within the next week. Because when I came down, it, it actually looked like a bird had jumped off that nest. Uh -huh. They would have seen what coming from real up there, and they would have started covering the nest up straight away, covering the eggs up and, and hid them. And then jumped off as we were closer. But anyways, that's a, a good end to the video for the day. Something I haven't seen in a few years, the little grapes. You get them in the, now the nature reserve type ponds, but... This is more in the wild. This thing. is a wild pond, this eye, uh, it's... It's not a lot of people know about this pond. Well, people know about it, but it's it's not man-made. Or if it was, it was about 20, 30 or 40 years ago. It's kind of... We're just up the top end of the pond again from where we were. But it's kind of hard to see, but just down there, between the branches of the trees and the reeds, it looks like a, a coot's nest. I'm just... Trying to zoom in on it. Because when we first came down, we've seen, seen a lot of young birds in the water just at this end as well. But we've only seen them from a distance, we weren't sure if they were coots or not. But that looks like a coots nest there. Can't really see it from where I'm standing, but I'm just using the camera. But I've got a good footage of it there. But the birds were just in these reeds when we came down. We just couldn't see them properly. It's standing on a bank side here. I'm right on the edge. It's all brambles all the way down. One slip and I'm ripped to bits. 
it's a nice sunny day. It's brilliant for this sort of thing. I'll get back over here because it's a bit, a bit wild and a bit rough. Ouch. There's a clear patch just here. And you kind of get doing that part. Nah, it's just, it's too rough, isn't it? Aye. Just trying to trying to look down. Where book? Oh, I threw the trees. Aye. If they gone into the side, I would have to get down here and just try and get them. Um. Oh, I was just about to go and yam. Ouch. I'm in a thorn bush. Getting ripped. Right. Just doing it on the side there, that's where they were. See where the gorse bush is hanging into the water? young when it has not it? Aye, it's a coot with a load of young there. Still quite a few. I'm shaking around a bit on. Do them not dip under the water the way they Them gone under the water they're as well, eh? I'll try and balance this camera a little bit better. I'm on a rough bank side. Now I've got a good footage of it there. But that's a quote at the top end of the pond. We'll, we'll call it a deer. I'm stuck in the bank side here. But what I was going to say was, that's where we found the Canada geese in there one year. Oh, right, that's the end of that. We're just on the way back to the core. And just in here, it's a little black cop's nest. A bit awkward to see there. It's got nothing in it at the minute, like, but... I'm going to get back over here because the, the bird's up there. We've seen the bird on up the tree when we came in and, and it was here when we came back so just thought we'd have a quick look. I'm going to get away from here before. Didn't want to be disturbing it for too long. I'll get some more footage of it when it lays the eggs and when it has the young ones and stuff like that. We'll be able to do it from the path of past just there.